Nelson Michael. Please put your hands together again for Nelson. Hello, everybody. How's everybody doing? So this is my first time speaking. I'm super excited to be here. Woo! Okay, everybody. All right. So uh, put your hands together for the Oscar team for organizing such a wonderful event. I mean, they're doing so much. Okay. So um, I'll be talking about monetizing technical writing. Before I go forward, uh, let me say a little bit about myself. All right, so this is Nelson. I'm a front-end developer at Chain Consult. We do a lot of um, contracting job for web applications, mobile applications, and a whole lot of companies. I'm also a freelance technical writer at LogRocket, CSS Tricks, and Bed Eats Bugs. And I'm a GDSC code that's fairly invested in local job. And fun fact, I think that Kanye West is a crazy genius. You got that right. You got that right. All right, so this is what we'll cover here today. Uh, a primer on technical writing, how to get paid as a technical writer, and then who pays technical writers. So let's get to the money. <laughs> All right, so this is just a, a brief definition of what technical writing is. So technical writing is using your specific skill sets or research skills to um, create textual content that instructs, directs, or explains a particular subject for your um, readers. So, um, I don't know what happened to my slides. Okay. So, this is uh, a benefit of tenka writing. Tenka writing is a great source of passive and primary income. So, imagine, yeah, you are learning how to code. You've not gotten a job yet, and, you know, you need to make money in some type of way to, like, maybe pay for courses, uh, pay for internet. Tenka writing is, like, a very good source of that. So, great source of passive income, great source of primary income. And it solidifies your knowledge on whatever you're learning. I mean, technical writing is great. It also improves your written communications. This is too much talk. Let me just. <laughs> so how to get paid as a technical writer? Put yourself out there. That's very important. Create value. So how do you put yourself out there? You can start blogging. I mean, there are a lot of platforms that allow you to blog for free. You can just connect your URL to it. Uh, platforms like Hashnode, Medium, Dev.2 wonderful platforms, creates good content, contributing to open source is another way to um, put yourself out there, join a community. The communities like um, Write the Docs, Hashnode as well, and build your portfolio. I mean, then create value. How do you create value? Effective communication. When you write, be clear and concise with your writing. So readers will not have to like, be too disturbed when reading your um, articles. Be sympathetic when you write. Don't write like you're talking to pros all the time. Just be simplistic when you write. Write as humanly as possible as well. That's a great way to create value for yourself. Uh, I know we're waiting for this. So how do you get paid as a technical writer? Who pays technical writer? Sorry. So full-time roles is a great way to get paid as a technical writer. Uh, freelancing. Also open source. So I did... Uh, this is just a research I did for how much technical writers get paid um, for full-time roles. So I don't want to talk too much on this because this is a little bit explanatory. But let me go to freelancing. So freelance technical writers make anywhere around $300 to $1,500 a month. It's just really dependent on your schedule. And that's a lot of money if you're learning how to code and you don't really have the resources. So um, for open source, okay, let me go back to this. So there are a lot of platforms that uh, pay freelance technical writers. Platforms like uh, LogRocket, CSS Tricks, uh, Bedditbox. All you have to do is just show them that you've been writing for a while. Um, show them your content, and that's it. I'll go back to that and explain that. Okay. So open source. Open source is another great way to get paid as a technical writer. Platforms like Outreachy. Um, Google Citizen of Docs, they pay ten characters well. And then for freelancing, I did the math. I know this makes me sound like I'm a genius. So in Naira, um, you can make anywhere around 190 to 600K per month for technical writing. And then for CDs, 2.5 for shillings, around 50K to 170K as a technical writer. And that's a lot of money. That could help you get somewhere before you get your job. So uh, this is a, you can scan this QR code for a list of platforms that pay technical writers. 
Shall I hold on? Okay. All right. There's also one platform I think you guys should check out. They're fairly new, Bed It Box, and they pay really well. So you guys should check that out as well. Okay. All right. Should I go to the next one? Can I move down? All right. So this is another list you can check out as well. Okay. Are we done scanning? <laughs> so can I move on now? <laughs> All right, so these are some awesome technical writers you can check out. They do um, a lot of technical writing, and then you can learn a lot from them and see how you can excel yourself as a technical writer. So I'm going to be signing off with this quote, one of my favorite quotes. No man ever waited clear and left his unexpected bricks by fortune and chance. So it takes hard work and consistency, and hopefully you get there. So thank you for having me, guys.